Hello learners, uh, welcome again to our session. I am your instructor, CPA Aringo Frederick. It's a continuation of what you are doing earlier on. In our class, we mentioned that today we are going to start with the establishment of external resource uh, department in the National Treasury. And to do that, we are supposed to look at this question, November 19, question number 2A. But before you go to that question, it will be very important for us to go deep into that and look at the following. It will be very important for us to go deep into that and look at the following. So anytime you are talking about, uh, remember the concept is establishment of external resource department in the National Treasury. Dissecting the National Treasury, some of its roles and why it was established. Remember, first of all, you need to know and understand that the National Treasury, of course, it has been established under the Constitution, meaning that it is there in the Constitution. And the main element or duty of the National Treasury is to make sure that they have budgeted and also ensuring that the expenditures and revenues within the country has been done effectively and efficiently. So this is why National Treasury was established, of course, under the Constitution of Kenya, with the mandate of doing the budgeting, the mandate of making sure that we've collected enough revenue and also talk of our money and also looking at how we spend the aspect of expenditures. To do that, maybe in that case, a good question to be asked is the main roles of uh, National Treasury. We can be asked the roles of National Treasury. We can be asked of the roles of uh, National Treasury. Roles of National Treasury. Roles of National Treasury. What would we say if you're asked to describe and give the roles of National Treasury? So the first role, anytime you're talking about the role of National Treasury, of course, is to assist the county government, is to assist the county governments to develop their capacity for efficient, effective, and transparent financial management. I repeat that statement you're saying. The first role of the Treasury is to develop their uh, to assist the county governments to develop their capacity for efficient, effective, and transparent financial management. That is number one. Number two role, we normally tend to talk about prepare the annual division of revenue bill. Prepare the annual division of revenue bill and the county allocation of revenue bill. And the county allocation of revenue bill also, you normally tend to talk about to coordinate the development and implementation, coordinate development and implementation of financial recovery plans, develop, uh, that is, uh, of course, coordinate development and implementation of financial recovery plans for county governments that are in financial distress, that are in financial distress. Also, the other point of uh, among the role of National Treasury, we normally tend to talk about uh, their role being strengthen financial and fiscal relations, strengthen financial and fiscal relations between national government and county governments and county governments and county governments and encourage and encourage support for county governments and encourage support for county governments in performing their functions, in performing their function, in performing their functions, in performing their functions, in performing their functions. So these are just some of the roles of the National Treasury. Because remember the main element you are talking about should be the establishment of external resource department and of course in the National Treasury. So it will have been very ideal for us, first of all, to look at what National Treasury entails. After that now, let us go deep and look at, whenever we are talking of ERD, what do we mean? External Resource Department. Anytime you are talking about External Resource Department, my good students, ideally, what do we mean? 
So anytime you're talking about external resource department, you just be looking at a department that is situated within the National Treasury. This department, you should understand that first of all, it is situated within the National Treasury. It is mandated to mobilize external resources their main mandate, we are saying the main mandate of ARDP, we should understand first of all, it is situated within the National Treasury. It is situated, it is situated within the National Treasury. It is situated within the National Treasury. It is situated within the National Treasury. That is very key for us to understand. And what it is main mandate. The mandate of the ERD, external resource department we've said is to the main mandate is to mobilize external resource is to mobilize external resource is to mobilize the external resource is to mobilize the external resource for government projects and programs for government projects for government for government projects for government projects for government projects, for government projects and programs, for government projects and programs. We are saying that the, their main aim or mandate is to mobilize external resources for government projects and what? For government projects and programs. So you'll find that uh, the department performs the above mandate under the provisions of the External Loans and Credits Act. So that is one main element that you should always be able to understand. Then a good question would be, what is the roles or functions of the ERD? So talk about their main functions will include the following. Their main functions will include the following. The functions of external resource department. Functions of external resource department will include the following. Number one. The coordination of negotiations between the government, the coordination and negotiations between the government and other countries or parties in relation to the government projects. We'll also be talking about uh, assistance to liars with ministries in the presentation of projects to be funded by the bank. Mm -hmm. We are saying assistance to, to liars with ministries in the preparation of projects to be funded by bank. Uh -huh. We can also talk about the aspect of our monitoring and evaluation of projects. Monitoring and evaluation of projects. The other number we are talking about facilitate the disbursement of project funds. Facilitate the disbursement of project funds. Attendance at project steering committee meetings. Attendance at project steering committee meetings. Project steering committee meetings. And so many other functions. And in this case, I want us to go to November 2019. November, that was a November 2019. Question number 2A. November 2019, question number 2A. I want us to go to that question, November 2019, question number 2A, believing that we do have our past papers and see how these questions are normally being tested. November 2019, question number 2A. November 2019, question number 2A. I believe that you are there. I believe that you are there. In this case, you are asked to... This is what you are told in that question. A number of countries have external resource departments as part of stimulating economic growth. Explain the roles of such departments. Explain the roles of such departments. Explain the roles of such departments. It is exactly as what we've mentioned. It is exactly as what we've mentioned amongst the functions of what? The functions of external resource department, which again you can also give them in brief where we mention to identify the sources of funds, to monitor and evaluate the projects, to continuously forecast and analyze the projects, Talk about to ensure there is proper authorization in disbursement of funds, etc, 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 etc. So you find that such questions can be tested like that. So to this point, my good student, I also want us to meet in the next session whereby 
we will talk about a promise the aspect of a promise which we're going to look at it as electronic project monitoring information system so to this point thank you so much and let us meet in the next session thank you